Welcome back everyone to another Brian's Diecast Thailand and today I'm just going to show you a few things that I picked up at the markets over the last few weeks now last week when I went there was a guy there that i would never seen before and he had three big bins he had one bin what was all just no brand stuff die cast then he had a bin full of models of yesteryears which were all still in the boxes so for someone who collects them I see lots of them at the markets and then he had another bin of loose models of yesteryears mixed in with a few other matchbox and things so I'll show you what I picked up the first one, this is unusual, I've never seen this. It's the a AMX Javelin. It's number nine uh, from 1972. I don't know whether you're going to get focus here again. But that I've never seen in blue before because normally they're this greeny colour that's the more common one with opening doors this one hasn't got opening doors and it's got a different wheel pattern on it um, it's not in real good condition but it is all there and I do believe that there's a red one of these which is very hard to find so anyway there's the first one so I won't show that other one because I So, next one I picked up, <clears throat> it's the Matchbox, and this has got the regular wheels, so it's a, quite an oldie. There is no date on there, but it's the steak truck, number four. All the sides and the back of everything on these are all broken off. I've got about three of these, and I've got one in just about mint condition so you know you could turn that into a flatbed and someone super glued these barrels on the back which I think is quite, quite cool because they're in scale just about I might take them off and keep them for a diorama or something that I might do one day anyway that's a steak truck and then We've got the Mercury Fire Chief. And now this is number 59 and 73. So I believe it's the Fire Chief and I think it was also a police car. Is it hard to say? Yeah, I think that's a super fast. Uh, that's all there. It has got a crack in the front window. But you know, I paid 20 baht each for these. And that's, <clears throat> well, 22 baht is a dollar Australian. So that's about just less than 50p UK. And what's that US? About 60 cents. So cheap as chips. And they actually even give me a couple for free. So anyway, next, rambling on, Majorette, and it's the Ferrari F40. Someone's painted it black, but that is all there. They even painted the windows, but it's doable. It's doable. Now the next one. This is something that I wouldn't normally go for. It's a um, Lado. Uh, Odell spelt backwards, because Odell used to work with Matchbox. And it's the Austin A35 van with Smarties on there. Smarties, 
Round Trees Limited, England, York, York, England. Uh, the reason I bought this, <clears throat> my brother learned to drive and passed his driving test in one of these. My brother's seven years older than me and he actually bought one of these brand new, brand spanking new, only well, his was green. So that's why I picked that one up. Just a bit of nostalgia, I think. Next one. This is another fire chief. But I think this is the one that's a fantasy. 1978 fire chief number 64, I think that is. Ah, no. Um, the bacon's there, but it's just squashed down and everything else is okay. Uh, 20 baht each, a dollar Australian. Here we have the uh, 1937 Bugatti Hot Wheels and it's stamped 1980. Hot Wheels are this way around, I have to remember. No, it's not this way. It did it then for a minute. Uh, it's missing its headlights. Um, everything else appears to be okay. I've got a box somewhere with headlights and stuff in. Uh, next one, this is a little bit different. We're back to Tomica here. And it's the Toyota... Pra Prairus, is it Prairus? Prairus, Prairus. Um, 1998 and it's number 86 and it's 158 scale. Um, open in front and there's a little button underneath there. Can you see it? You press that to... Uh, I can't do it with one hand. You press that and then you can lift the bonnet. Metal body, metal base, so that's okay. I like metal bodies, metal base. And then we've got this one. This is the, uh, it's a king, matchbox king size number two. And it's the Moorhill dump truck. Now I've got two more of these. And I'll just show you. The other ones I've got, see it's got black with green wheels, whereas this is grey. And on this one, these meant to be, you can turn these round and you can drive these. I mean, oh dear. You can drive them going that way. <laughs> Or you can spin where the driving seat is and you can drive them that way. So pick that one up because it's got different wheels. And the next one we've got Bentley. It's a four and a half litre Bentley, 1928. Models of yesteryears, and it's a number three. I'm not going to waste showing you. It's missing the spare tire on the side, missing the headlights. I've got two more of these, and I think one of them's got headlights on it. Oh, one of the tires is not correct. But yeah, I think with the three I've got, I could make one good one. Nearly finished, guys. Next one's another model of yesteryears. And it's the Rolls Royce Silver Ghost. 1969, and it's Y10. Now, that is all there. 
usually them back seats go missing all the tyres are on it headlights are on it she's complete and the last one it's another Rolls Royce doesn't say what it is on this one it just says modelled of yesteryears Rolls Royce made in England by Lesnick and that one is all there tyres everything oh the spare tyres missing but that's not a problem I've got spare tyres so yeah that's just a quick show you what I picked up at the market to a new guy that I've never never seen him there before 20 by each and he gave me about I mean, three of these he gave me for nothing so you can't say nothing about that can you it's a little pan hope you enjoyed that leave us a comment let us know what you think stay safe everyone and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.